This is Tower. Launch sequence engaged. Hey guys, alright, so I have a, another trick for you. Um, this involves a blue deck of cards, okay? And uh, <clears throat> what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to grab a couple um, prediction cards. We'll just call those prediction cards, okay? So I'm going to cut off a little bit. I'm going to steal a card. Eh, stay. I'm going to cut off a little bit. I'm going to steal a card. I'm going to cut off a little more. And I'm steal another card. Okay, so now we have three prediction cards that you can see all came from different parts of the deck. Okay, so I'm going to take those cards and I'm going to put them down just over here. Okay, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to get somebody to, um, is, uh, pick a card, okay? And the way we're going to do that is uh, by spreading out the deck just a little bit, just like this, right? And I usually, if I have a spectator here, I riffle down and I say, I'm going to get you to say stop whenever you want. And whenever you say stop, that's where we'll cut to, okay? So they're going to go ahead and say stop whenever they want. And I say, you have to do it before we get to the bottom of the deck, okay? So I'm going to say stop whenever you want. They say stop. I say cool. We cut the deck there. And we take the card that they cut to, which happens to be the Jack of Hearts. Good card. But we'll take these cards and put them over here just like this. Okay, so now they took the Jack of Hearts, and I have three prediction cards. So I'm going to take this... Um, and that's what we have. We have three prediction cards and a uh, selection card. Okay. Now I say to them, uh, this is, I say to them, this is your card, and we're going to take it. We're going to put it down here. Now, wouldn't it be crazy if any of these three cards happen to be match your card right here? And I say, look. One of my prediction card one of my prediction cards matches your selection card. I'll take that and put it over there and check it out. Second one matches your prediction card. Alright. I'll say look, look at the last one. It also matches your prediction card. How utterly crazy is that? Alright. But then again, you know what? You can actually say that that's almost a miracle because there isn't a single deck in the entire world that has four Jack of Hearts in it. Now, that could be a miracle or that could just be an illusion. See, now it could be an illusion because let's just say that this card came from a black deck. Alright? And let's say that this Jack of Hearts, maybe this Jack of Hearts, came from a yellow deck. And let's say that this Jack of Hearts came from an oddly colored deck, leaving us with only one Jack of Hearts, the one that you took from this deck. Now, remember I said that that would almost be a miracle? Well, what would be even more of a miracle is if somebody could explain to me how all of these different cards, including your blue back Jack of Hearts, came from a red deck of cards.